we're using the mural project, the paintings, as a way to elevate Palestinian voices, especially in an area that has a lot of um, quote-unquote archaeological development, like as settlers, they're promoting an Israeli narrative or some kind of untrue or misguided history about the place and trying to erase Palestinians. But with the paintings, we're trying to elevate that history more because Palestinians are, of course, such a, a crucial and beautiful part to Jerusalem and this land. And we're using paintings as a voice to speak out visually because visual works of art can uh, transcend language as well. We've painted the eyes of not just Palestinian activists or, or people from the neighborhood, but also uh, like George Floyd, uh, Rachel Corey. Anything that's being done here in, in uh, support of of Palestine and Palestinians is a form of resistance. Palestinians are, are kind of absent from the overall experience of people who come, let's say tourism for instance, and this includes you know Zionist tourists who are coming here, maybe they're Christian or they're Jewish or you know they're coming here to visit Jerusalem. It's important for them to understand where they are, you know, that, that this land is Palestine. The project itself is uh, it's very important because the people here need to be seen, they need representation. So you know it's Palestinians are, are on their, we're on our own in a way, you know.